Hey everyone, thanks for coming back for another segment of The MCR. Mac is to my left in his very colorful patriotic shirt. God bless America. And my name is TJ, wearing the army hat, which after what I heard about uh, critical race theory and uh, West Point, that's a whole nother segment which would compel one to vomit. In any event, uh, please like, share, and subscribe. We're on multiple platforms, multiple social media sites, one in particular which we will be referencing here in a few minutes. But I, I, I don't know if Mac feels exactly the way I feel, but I would just ask rhetorically, how the heck are we going to make it to November? I don't know. I just, uh, when, you, when you think of the chaotic, out of control tantrum response of the left, uh, the vandalism, I mean... Uh, you know, we're, uh, we're, we, we're launching into another summer of love. But, uh, you know, Marjorie Taylor Greene was outside the Supreme Court when they were releasing the Roe v. Wade decision. They had to get her out of there because she was on the verge of being violently attacked. Okay. Uh, I listen to Dan Bongino a lot. And I got to tell you that the guy is really becoming pretty doggone polished in his presentation uh, in the 12 to 3 p.m. Uh, uh, hour, you know, in, okay. in, in place of Rush. Uh, they couldn't have picked a finer guy to do what he's doing. But Dan Bongino has begun saying repeatedly, almost on a daily basis now, keep your head on a swivel. Uh, just meaning these, these people are going to attack you. Yeah. Uh, Dan Bongino has shared with his listening audience that He's got to have 24-hour security on his home. If he goes out into the public, he's got to have a security detail with him. Otherwise, he's going to be violently attacked. And, you know, with their, one of your favorite words, propensity, with their propensity to commit acts of violence. Uh, they, That's well established. Uh, you know, brings me back to my rhetorical question. Are, are we going to make it to November? You know? You have to remember, Democrats, this is nothing new. Their reaction to the freed slaves was to create the Ku Klux Klan I, and, and, and terrorize people by like burning crosses on their lawns, grabbing people, hanging them, and just uh, putting the fear of God in people, and that's what they're trying to do here again. They're trying to make us so afraid we'll give them what they want. And, you know, it. they've... they've become so deluded in their in, in, in what they want they have somehow reasoned that their cause is so just and pure that uh, that uh, they must act this way I mean it's not even a matter of should they in their mind they have determined they must act out in this manner because because their cause is so just and pure and virtuous and Blah, blah, blah. Uh, you know, they, they've referred to us as domestic terrorists. Uh, of the worst kind. Yeah. Uh, Threatening our democracy. President Brandon referring to us as ultra, ultra mega, I want to say. Uh, you know, they, they attacking churches and disrupting services and, and vandalizing uh, uh, Pregnancy centers, as far as uh, well, well, like Christian one, organizations. One of the things centers. that was put on one of the pregnancy centers was, if abortions aren't safe, you aren't either. Yeah, neither are you. And and so you know this, uh, and, and you know then the Democrats tacit approval of this type of conduct. Right. Uh, in in one of the social media sites that uh, Mac here navigates. We had a we had a comment in particular that we would like to reference, going to my point. If if you could, uh, if you could do so at this time, Matt. Yeah. Uh, this person says, it is. I'm not going to give the name of the person because I don't want to have problems with them. But uh, I, I I complained about this, and I ne this is something I never do. I never I never report someone. But this this one needs to be reported before. It falls into the hands of the wrong people. Uh, he, he, he's not saying go forward and protest peacefully, which obviously means go to the Capitol and burn it down. Uh, he's saying forcing raped women to give birth is a GOP, GOP platform that will cause great harm. 
None of that is true, by the way. After all, that's why we have the Second for Amendment. For times like this, if the government tries to force anyone to give birth, I'd be very happy to see a few 308s, referring to the caliber of round, go through all the all of the GOP politicians' heads. How do you what do you what how do you react to that? I didn't, by the way. Well, that 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 goes to Dan Bongino saying, "Keep your head on a swivel." Uh, you know, uh, it, it's just. Uh, and as I like to say, you can't reason with this logic. Well, I'm sure this, this person is typing this from their mom's basement. Yeah. Safe in the fact that the, nothing's going to happen to them. Oh, and by the way, in regards to retalk here, this hasn't been taken down yet. Maybe they haven't gotten to my complaint yet. But it seems fine with retalk that they're talking about murdering all of the GOP politicians. Yeah. That's not a problem. Going to what we said in previous segments about there being a two-tier law system, we get prosecuted and persecuted, they walk scot-free without yeah. even bail. Uh, and and I, I, we use this comment as, as, as an example of, i, I got to tell you, God Almighty, if, if we don't, if we don't, well, you know what, it, it's a, either, either, either way it's going to be bad, because if we do take the house, what's going to happen then? <laughs> Well, if Kevin McCarthy is the speaker, nothing. Yeah, but what I'm saying though is, if 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 we take majority of the House, the left is is gonna. I mean, if if they if they haven't already resorted to full meltdown mode. Well, the the media will cry. The election was stolen. Blacks, the black vote was suppressed, uh, which is nonsense. Uh, I just uh, and and you know I I. Uh, a couple weeks ago, I, I did a segment on on the necessity to be prepared. Yes. Uh, this is you know, we're, and we're going to use this guy as our as our prime example of the necessity of being prepared. Yeah. I mean, uh, if this guy has his way, you know, the cold civil war goes hot. Yeah. He you he know? makes a couple of claims that women are forced to have babies when they're raped. That's not true. None of that's true from the Roe versus Wade decision. And my original comment was something to the effect of I expected a violent leftist temper tantrum because they've been told no, and they don't get told no. And if they are told no, well, we're going to tear shit up. Well, I, one, of the, one of the YouTube channels that I kind of watch a fair amount of is Black Scout Survival. Uh, I think the name is, I think the guy's name is uh, Scout Survival. And, and he, he always ends his videos with something to the effect of, uh, stay frosty, stay strapped. <laughs> and, you know, if, if, if this guy wants to put 308s through whoever's head, uh, you know, yeah, I guess uh, stay frosty, stay strapped. Now, let's say you, know? you or I said that on there. I have a feeling not only would the comment be gone, but the MCR would be kicked off retalk in a big hurry. Well, so I, I don't know much about retalk, but other than I'm a little disappointed that I didn't even get a response saying we disagree. Uh, apparently they don't disagree. They're all for the murder of conservatives and anybody who doesn't give in to the mob. We, I was, we were just compelled to reference that in regards to, you know, man, making it to November. And, and, even, and even when we do make it to November, assuming we make it to November, then what? Then, then, then where do we go? Then what will the state of affairs be? Yeah. Uh, but I, I guess... Tom well, we're going to submit to their will, or we're not. That's Those are, those are going to be... Those are our choices. Submit to their will, or not. And, and you know, and they're already saying that uh, we're a threat to democracy. Yeah. You know, how, how is that comment not a threat to democracy? Yeah, if you don't, you don't do what I say, I'll kill you. I just yeah. uh, any anyways that that's that's all I that's all I wanted to yeah, I just had to rant, rant okay that, that's that's all I want any any further nope, comment that's it. Th thanks for hanging tough everyone uh, hopefully no one takes uh, takes their anger out on you you know uh, so as always be safe watch your six and don't tread on me.